Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So, Pisces, what I need for you to do right now is I need for you to go to the refrigerator and make some tacos for me. And then you can give me that good energy by clicking that like button. You can comment. You can share, you can subscribe, you can just do all those beautiful, magical mother trucking things that you do to me so well here at Talia Sarah. So, I'm going to slap down the holy water. Yes, yeah, see? <sighs> so good in the neighborhood, Pisces. So, you know what time it is, baby. Mm -hmm. Tarot is now in session. The most honorable judge, T.T. T. Dong, presiding. You can all lay down and pet your kitty cat and your doggies. So, we're going to check in on the energy of the person you're dealing with or whatever energy might be coming towards you, my beautiful loves. Whatever the case is, we're going to get it, we're going to hit it, and we're going to quit that shit together just like we always do, baby. Yeah, yeah. Show! going on over here. Show me the energy of the person my beautiful Pisces is dealing with. Okay, okay. Show me the energy of the person my be Okay, all right, all right, okay. All right. Show me the energy of the person my beautiful Pisces. Oh, top to bottom. Come on, baby. Let's go. Show me the energy of the person my beautiful. Oh, all right. What do we got here, guys? Okay. Uh-oh. Looks like we've got sword fight today. All right, down on the table, Pisces. I've got the Five of Cups. I've got the Ten of Wands. I've got the Empress. I've got the Eight of Swords. The overall energy for the reading here is the Queen of Cups. Okay, Queen of Cups. She gives. She is fair with her emotions. She doesn't hold back anything. She's very logical and empathic. Five of Cups in your person energy here, okay? So basically right now, your po person here is focused on everything that has gone wrong here, okay? Overthinking it, just too too many thoughts here. We got 10 wands down here, okay? This is a heavy load for your person to carry. A lot of burdens here. And we got the Empress as the Divine Mother. Uh, she's radiant, you know, everybody loves the Empress. She goes into the room and the room stops and everybody looks at her. We've got eight swords down here on the table. So your person's not moving right now, okay? They are basically in a self-imposed prison here. Oh, no, Pisces. So we will clarify after these commercials. Okay, I'm back. Just joking. There's no commercial. <laughs> All right. So let's, uh, let's, let's talk to these eight swords to see what this person is overthinking. What is this person trapped in their thoughts about with the eight swords? What is this person? Oh, God. Hold on a second, guys. Okay. Trapped in their thoughts here about the six swords. Let's get one more on that for contrast. Let's go eight swords to six swords. Okay. Okay. It seems like your person here is wanting to move out of... There's some conflicting thoughts this person's having. And this person is like... They are not going to share their thoughts here. All they're saying here is that there's conflicting thoughts and they just want to move away from overthinking and go towards something else here with the eight cups. So what would this person, what are they going to go towards here with these eight cups, please? Let's go, 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 eight cups. Where are they going with these eight cups? What are they walking towards with these eight cups, please? Ooh, shuffle truffle, let's go. Get out my truffle sniffing hog. Where are they going to? Okay. It seems like they are going to go into hermit mode, isolate themselves, and do some thinking here about a decision that they need to make here. So what is this decision that this person is going to go into isolation here and decide on what to do here? What's this decision about? Let's go. This decision is about seven of swords. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, Pisces. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. And, yep, to the world card here. Uh, so I feel like this person here, oh, boy. There's something here, conflicting thoughts that they just want to get out of here. And I feel like this person 
might kind of, I feel like they might disappear for a little while and do some traveling here, go somewhere and isolate themselves because it seems like a heavy energy. So I feel like this person just wants to get out of Dodge right now for a little bit. Okay. Oh, brother Pisces. Okay. So what, what did they fuck up here with the five cups? What did they fuck up with the five cups? Let's go. What did they fuck up? King cups. <laughs> Let's get one more on the king cups with the five cups. King cups with the five cups. I knew that was going to come out. I don't even, I could just talk and I'd be fine. Yeah, well, they didn't tell you how they felt about you here with the king cups and the ace of cups. So look at that person. I mean, there's your person. They're on the table. They're focused on the one cup here. You got the ace of cups here. The king cup is also holding the ace of cups here. So basically here, this person did not express their feelings of love towards you here. Oh, God. And they're focused on that. And that is the only thing that this person focuses on right now. So let's go walk to ten wands here and see what's going on here with ten wands. So what is this heavy burden this person's getting ready to put down? here. Show me this heavy burden they're getting ready to put down. What is this? Okay. Ugh. Yeah. Four swords there. That's carrying a sense of uh, heartache with it here. So basically right now what this person's wanting to do is put down their burdens here and kind of start work on healing themselves here. Oh boy. Let's go one more on the four swords for some contrast. Let's go. Four swords with the ten wands. Let's go. Four swords with the ten wands. Top to bottom, I don't know what that was. Let's go. Four swords, ten wands. Let's go. They're going to make me shuffle truffle today. And get out my hog sniffing truffle today. Okay. So, yeah, this person's just going to... They're putting down their burdens here. They want to start healing themselves here. And I feel like this person here... With these two wands, knows that they're at the crossroads here on something. So what is this? Uh, what is? What are they at the crossroads on here with the two wands? Two wands. Let's go. Two wands. What are they at the crossroads here on? Two swords. They're feeling. Damn. Damn. That's two to the two. Okay. It's like they really need to sit and think about this before they even take the blindfold off here and make a decision here. Okay. So they're going to sit here and meditate. And the Four of Swords is a card of meditation as well as healing here. So right now, it's like this person feels like they can't do anything. They still got to think more. So what are they going to think more here before they make this decision? What are they going to think more about before they make this decision? What are they going to think more about before they make this decision? The devil. Oh, no, Pisces. It is el diablo. No bueno rollo diablo here. Okay, mm -hmm. so there's some toxic shit that this person has. It could be drugs, drinking, sex, eating too much McDonald's. I don't know. But uh, they need to get rid of this devil energy here before they can even make a decision here and approach you. Oh, boy, Pisces. Okay. So let's talk to the Empress and let's see what the Empress is here for. Why is she here? Empress, why are you here? Yeah. The Empress is here because this person here is sitting around their house in their devil energy. They got a sock puppet with googly eyes on it and your name on it. And basically, you know, they're thinking about you here with their little sock puppet here. And how much emotion and how much love that they have for you here and it's like they feel like you guys should be together here okay under this empress energy but right now this person is just they're taking a break here and might leave town for a little while here so what's the potential outcome what does, what's the potential out i'm going to grab a different deck here show me the potential outcome with these energies on the table let's go potential outcome with the energies on the table there's that overthinking again six cups potential outcome please Potential outcome. There's the hermit. Damn. Potential outcome. This person's going to really... There's the... <sighs> eight swords. Damn, Pisces. Two different decks right there. The potential outcome is the same thing that is literally on the table. They're going to sit and contemplate this a little bit more before they can even make a decision here. And they're definitely overthinking you with their sock puppet, Pisces. <laughs> Sock puppets here. 
Oh my God, she is such a bitch. She always ruins my good time. I just can never have fun anymore. All right, we're going to clear it off with the white sage, get the final messages, and see what else this person would like to tell you before I close off this mother truck and read. All right, let's go. What else do you want to tell Pisces? Let's go. Sure. Six swords. Look at that, man. It's backing my truck up. They're going somewhere. They're going away for a while. We got the tower coming in. This person is drowning in their emotions right now. Oh, shit. Yeah, and then we got the Hierophant here. So, Pisces, I don't know. Somebody might, uh, I don't know. They might They might be uh, wanting you as a potential life partner here. So, this has been your reading. Thank you for joining me on another episode of As the Fish Swims. These are the tales of your fins. Tales adjourned.